Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Thank each and every one of y'all for clicking on the video. Today is going to be a start of a new adventure. Um, so the kids don't know what's what's been going on, but me and Steph's been talking about um, building some type of little fort or something that we can actually come down to the creek and, and uh, stay the night down here, just to let them experience it. So as many of y'all know, the kids love coming down to the creek and uh, I bet you that'd spend every day if we'd allow them. But school has started, so I'm going to be starting this project by myself and then uh, we will let the kids, surprise the kids with it, whether they see the video or they actually come out here. Um, as y'all remember the last video we filmed down here we actually burnt some of the brush away and stuff but um there was a there was a, another big storm that come through and i was really expecting the creek to be up but as you can see that some of the there's some more trees and stuff that are hung up so we're going to ease down there and take a look at it and then after that we are going to take a look up here somewhere and find us a good place and we're going to uh start building a little fort or something that we can uh, kind of camp in just hang out and just have a good time so hope you enjoy this video if you're not subscribed go ahead and subscribe to our channel and check that notification bell that way you don't miss any of our latest video so as you can see here uh, the sand has moved a little uh, looks like just a little not much but uh you can see all the brush is gone now uh, we fixed that up and burnt that away but as you see there's there's a whole new uh batch of uh trees there so we'll probably we'll probably let them dry and end up um uh burning that out as well you can see that there's tons of little bitty fish in here oh yeah there's some big ones down there too good lord look at all them little catfish catfish and bass we get our fort clubhouse whatever you want to call it up here started we are going to get rid of that log some way one way or or, or another um just so we can clean it out but uh anyways let's go up here and try to find us a good place to uh start building so i just noticed that uh, looks like the creek has did make it up to about right here you can see you can see how the water's kind of washed it away there but uh yeah I have I have seen it before where the creek is way up and you can't even uh, couldn't even get be down in this area. Um, there's there's a couple good spots that we could build a fort, but I, I don't know if I'm pretty sure I want it on this side of the creek. Um, I'm not 100% certain, but we're going to try to figure it out. All right, guys. After doing some looking around, um, I do know that the creek does get way up here if we get a bunch of rain. I'm thinking. I don't know if you can tell right back there, but there's like a hill. It kind of, it's got a rise to it. I'll try to zoom in, see if you can see it there. There's a rise to it. And then we'll start finding some uh, small tree limbs and stuff, and we'll start building the fort, clubhouse, whatever the kids want to call it. I'll let them decide that when we get started. Um, and again, guys, man, I apologize about the videos. I don't have to apologize, but I feel bad. We have, I've been so busy at work and I have fell back on my videos. Um, it's really upsetting. Um, I, I keep telling myself that, you know, I'm gonna try to film, you know, during the day before I go to work, but it's just been so busy at work. There's three of us and, uh, or four of us now, and that we've had so much stealing going on, it's unreal. So we're gonna try to get caught up. I'm gonna try to get some videos ahead so we don't fall behind like we have. So um, anyways, we wanna thank y'all so much for following us and just showing us um, all the love and support y'all give to our channel. Thank y'all so much. But um, with all that being said, let's go ahead and get started. All right, guys, I think we're gonna go ahead and park our wagon right here and we're gonna get everything out and set it up and uh, we should be good to go. I brought a drill uh, so we could do some building. All right, there's my screws. Drill. And as you know, now that we have this solar power generator here uh, from Blue Eddy, 
we are definitely going to use this to charge our GoPro batteries and everything like that, just like we do at the creek. So I'm gonna get all of our cords out, hook them up. I'm telling you, um, this thing is a lifesaver, um, especially you know, all we was really wanting one is to charge our stuff and our batteries and stuff because we do a lot of filming at the property and we don't have um, we don't have power out there yet. So we're we'll gonna get this all hooked up here. Let this charge while It's charging. We got this battery going. I've got another one somewhere. I think it's in my pocket. You never can have too many batteries, especially for these GoPros. And as many of y'all know, I use the GoPro 8. Um, that's just what I prefer. But we use three of them, and uh, we try to keep all the batteries charged at all times it takes quite a bit to keep them all charged uh, we got we got three charged two we're down one so anyways now we're going to get our gopros and set them up in the right spot so we can shoot a good video like i say all the stuff that i'm using here i'll i'll use a i'll leave a link down below and we'll set these here up here in just a second all right get everything adjusted and then, as y'all know, I'm going to get to use my favorite toy, and uh, we're going to cut a path through here. Well, I've used this CC saw probably about, I don't know how many times I've used it. I've used it a bunch, and, um, and as y'all seen in the video. So, it's going to definitely make it easy to get in there and try to start building our fort. Um, but I'm going to let the kids decide on what they want to call it or whatever. This is really a surprise for them. And uh, which this will just be the start of it. So, I mean, kind of give me an idea what we're going to do. Set that down there. Go ahead and get this plugged in. I'm telling you, if you if you use if you um, work a lot outside and you don't have a um, actual if you don't have a actual electricity or whatever this blue eddy has definitely been a lifesaver for us and uh, I, I know that we you know a lot of the videos that we've been making has got products that companies have sent us um, so a, as you know is you know we film our family we share our life with the world and, and I love doing that and I love communicating with everyone I've had comments saying, you know, y'all selling products, so it's all about the products. It's not about that. Um, you know, now that we have uh, grown the channel so as big as it is, it, it's, you know, you kind of, um, we're, we're kind of using it as an extra income now. Um, so the opportunity of these companies uh, reaching out to us to see if we'll review their product or use it has definitely been awesome for us. As y'all know, if y'all do click on a link down below, and buy a product or whatever that, that we use, we get a small percentage of it. It's nothing extra that you pay, it's already into the price. It's the company uh, will, will give us a small percentage for using their product and directing customers to their product. And I will say, any of the products I use on my channel, they're legit. If, if I wouldn't buy it or if I wouldn't use it, I'm not going to, to try to uh, force you not force you but tell you it's a good product and it's it's not I have several products at home that has never made it on air and it won't make it on air and I'm straight up with the companies if I won't use it I'm not going to try to uh, show it to my my subscribers which our subscribers are like our family <clears throat> excuse me um, we have we have grown to to know uh, we've met a couple of y'all a few y'all in person but um, visiting with y'all every day is is awesome y'all are 
y'all are our family now. So um, uh, I've got to sharpen the um, the chainsaw that that we use before we get off in there. The company um, CC actually sent us a chainsaw sharpener um, for a chainsaw. He, they, um, which is just in the box I'll open up here in just a second and show you. They, they, they got a kick out of it, how, how, how much I use it and how much I like it. Uh, I just get it fascinated with stuff like that. It's absolutely awesome. Comes with the charger, um, which we've already charged it. Got your uh, protection gloves. You got your actual, um, it's kind of like a, a Dremel uh, tool, but it's, it's, for sharpening the blades you can use it for other things but we're using it for sharpening the blades and then you got all your little uh, attachments and gadgets I mean if, oop, if you need to cut something there's the glass cutter there's a little metal grinder so there's several things that you, you can use this die grinder for so I'm gonna go ahead and leave them in there um, the thing that we're going to be using today is these right here the actual chainsaw sharpeners um, so that's what we're going to work on real quick before we actually start cutting and then hopefully today we can just clear a path through here where we're going to actually set it up so hope you stay tuned plug this in this is a, a 12 volt lithium I've never used this one before so uh, let's go that we got that I'm going to go ahead and oil it while we're here so oiling these CC chainsaws are very very easy um, you just put a couple dabs of oil around the chain and on the back side and just rub it in there and then you're good to go and you're good to go. You got you a PC chainsaw. So anyways, enough with all that stuff. Let's get in here and start cutting. Gloves on that would uh, still get me. So trying to get this path through here for. So we haven't made it very far, but we're making a little bit of progress. Um, I'm going to try to get right back up in there, if you can see, right there on top of that hill. And I think that's a pretty good area that we can actually uh, start uh, clearing it out. 
and then we can start bringing some wood and stuff uh, cutting some small trees and building our own little um, clubhouse or fort whatever you want I know the kids are going to love it that's all that matters ah that gum Alright guys, so we have made it to the area that I'm actually going to build the little uh, clubhouse or fort. Um, we're going to put it right here in this area. You've got a nice little breeze coming through here. And even if we have to open up some more uh, at, at, once we get everything built, or even before, just because it's so hot down here by the creek, there's really not a breeze today, which is kind of odd here in Oklahoma, as you can see. But... Um, like I said, I've been wanting to do this for the kids for a long time. Um, they love it down here at the creek, so might as well try. I've got a couple hours we'll have to go to work, so I'm going to try to get a little bit more cut. And uh, we'll just do a little by little. And hope you all enjoy. Uh, please leave some comments down below on your thoughts. or um, Yeah, so thank you all so much. But um, anyways, before we get any further, I'm going down to the creek to get something to drink. It is extremely hot. I wouldn't, I say hot. I say hot. Um, it's not hot. It's just there's no air and it's humid. But uh, yeah, you can already t uh, tell the difference coming through here, which is cool because we can go back on videos that we've shot before and uh, kind of see the difference. So I'm just an old country boy. So. I'm going to go down here to the creek, get me a little bit of water, and uh, anything just to uh, keep the body hydrated. I should have brought some water, but we didn't have any water bottles at home or any like water bottles from the store. Uh, so we're definitely going to have to get some of those. But here's the deal there's a creek right here, so it ain't going to hurt you. Hopefully I'll make it. Oh yeah. I remember drinking creek water when I was a kid in the hayfield. Which, honestly, I think this water tastes better than the water at our house. The water at the house tastes like cor uh whatever you call it. That's some good stuff. All right, let's go back up here and do a little bit more cutting. And then we gotta go back to the house and get ready for work. I think we're gonna have to open some of this up so we can get a breeze. So I'm gonna kinda cut this tree back a little bit. So I hope you all enjoy this next journey we're fixing to take. I, I mean, we're not going to be out here every day, but just when we have time, we're going to come out here and uh, 
I just want a cool place for the kids to hang out and us and I think this is it um, if something happens home's not very far away and I'm sopping wet I mean literally anyways I want to thank each and every one of y'all for watching if you're not subscribed to our channel go ahead and subscribe to our channel and check that notification bell that way you don't miss any of our latest videos thank you and God bless